Great. And uh, when you got to the end of a climb and you're walking off the crag, you've got to coil the rope up. The best way to coil a rope up to carry it off a crag is to find a middle marker, pop your thumb through it, take it over the back of your shoulders, bring your arms straight, pick it up from here, over your shoulders, pick it up, over your shoulders, keep going till you get to the end of the rope, or near the end of the rope. If your hands get full, drop it and start again. I've got little hands so they get full easily. To carry a rope off, we can carry it like a rucksack. You need to leave the tails quite long. So I tend to leave about three metres and then take your rope off your neck. There you go. Ooh, don't drop a coil. And we've got it over one wrist. I then take the tails, go round the back into my hand, round the back to here. Do four or five wraps so it's nice and tight. And twist that to there. When I've done enough wraps around here, keep hold of it with that hand. I tend to hold it between my knees, pull a loop through, and then pop this over the top a little bit like a hood, I guess. Like this. And then you pull in the tail down, and that locks those coils so they won't come undone. And then we've got these tails here left over to use as a rucksack. Take one in each hand, pop it over your shoulders, and we've got it here, so it's on my back. I'm gonna pass it in front of my chest and cross it over. Go behind my back, cross it over the top of the coils, bring it in front here, and then tie in a reef knot. To tie a reef knot, I'm gonna put left over right and tie a normal knot, a bit like the start of my shoelaces. I'm gonna put right over left, tie a normal knot, the cycle my shoelaces. It should look like this. If it doesn't look like this, it's not a reef knot, do it again. If you've still got some tails, you can tuck them away somewhere like that. And then you're ready to walk off. You don't have to carry a rope. Hands free.